Authority Local Weather Forecast. Welcome back. Well, we are feeling the heat today, so we do have hot temperatures with us, and you can just see it right now. Currently where we sit, so 112 in Yuma, 111 in YPG, a little bit cooler in Imperial at 109. So we are feeling these hot temperatures for now, and we are under an excessive heat warning until 8 p.m. tomorrow. That does include portions of Yuma and Imperial counties where highs potentially could reach as high as 116. So it is going to be very hot. So, of course, practice heat safety all hours of the day. Very important to help us with this excessive heat for now. But this is also what I'm looking out for. Not only the heat, but also monsoonal moisture. So we're having lots of it coming up from the south. So we will have potential for some rain showers and opportunities even for the next couple of days and more so in the weekend. And as we look at our satellite and radar, as of right now, we are seeing a lot of activity within the region. So for us here, let's take a closer look on what's going on. So we did see some heavier clouds earlier this morning and a little bit of mixture of some sunshine later on this afternoon, but starting to see a little bit more of that development coming up from the south, bringing us a little bit of clouds, also some storm activity off to the sides of us. So it's something I'll be looking out for very, very closely with these storms. And it's not going to end there because we do have a newly developed tropical storm and meet Hillary. This is Hillary. She formed earlier this morning and she's continuing to possibly intensify and also travel up to the Baja Peninsula as we head into our Thursday. So this could intensify into a hurricane, possibly even a category three. So it's something I'll be continuing to track because it could bring us impacts of widespread um, rainfall for us here in the Southwest. So that's something I'll be looking out for. We'll have big changes with that um, this weekend. But first, let's take a quick look on our air quality index sponsored by Imperial County Air Pollution Control District. We have a mixture of moderate and good, but nothing too concerning. Not too bad as of right now, but on our eight day forecast, let's go ahead and break everything down on what's to come in the coming days. So we'll hold on to the excessive heat for now, but then look at this weekend. We are going to have chances where we could experience likely rain showers and thunderstorms due to that tropical moisture and look at our temperatures major drop with those. We'll see some mid 90s, even some upper 80s and even overnight lows are going to be cool. But yes, we will have lots of opportunities for rain showers and thunderstorms. Mainly the greatest chances are Sunday through Monday and will linger even into Tuesday. So something I'll be looking out for very closely and keep you all informed on that. So definitely prepare for what's to come. Back to you, Scott. Thank you, Melissa. When